whatever, whatever I think that DC will, you know, move on from all this drama and all this, you know, they will build some goodwill with the audience. And here is uh, James Gunn. He comes out of nowhere, who is the head of DC studio. And he says all of this thing to further damage this DC brand overall. That's what I feel like. So here's the thing, you know, the last, the last trailer, ever since that trailer dropped, I think people were a little bit forgiving toward all the things happened in the past, you know, all this review, uh, DCU reboot and all this hiring and firing. But here you go, he just comes out and he says this thing, of course, it makes people angry at him or DC at again. This guy is really crazy. He need to stop going to Twitter and tweeting anything. That is said, uh, of course, he just tweeted this here. Basically, he revealed that uh, he's been working on this Superman project uh, last six months. Like one of they hired him and uh, he's working on this project, which is nothing new, I suppose. They did ask him to write this DC movie like DC Superman movie, uh, I think the only problem here is this, that uh, because the, in, in Hollywood Reporter, they did reveal, you know, one that they were looking for someone to write the Superman movie. They were just not sure who's going to play the Superman. But ever since Henry Cavill, he announced he was back in uh, Black Adam post credit scene. That scene is so good. It's really sad, I guess. Anyway, ever since he announced that, of course, people thought he will be back as the Superman. But when we look back... Uh, Looks like he never had a deal from Warner Brother, which is, yeah, we are all trying to move on with this thing because ever, even though I saw the Flash trailer, I thought it did look amazing, but the, that trailer, when I look into that trailer and movie, felt like, you know, Henry Cavill, he should be there, you know, but he isn't. Uh, in a way, Flash movie is taking place in that universe, you know, and uh, people are really excited to see that movie. And I don't know if it will be huge hit or not. I do think it will be hit if the movie is good. Uh, yeah, of course, now he's coming out and he's saying this thing, reminding people that, you know, Henry Cavill, how bad Warner Brothers were with him. And the, the people were really excited to see him back. Now he's saying this thing. Now I feel so mad at him. This guy is not fit to lead, you know, DC head, and uh, as much as he can, people are like, uh, you know, they, they have a lot of faith in him, they're thinking he will bring all this amazing movie, none of the DC Slate movie he announced, the people are not that excited, people are not over the moon as much as they saw the trailer, flash trailer, they are, so you know, I, I don't know if he's jealous of that or what, he's coming back and bringing Handicable one more time in the conversation, End of the day, it is at this point, it's really clear he doesn't like Henry Cavill. More than anything, he doesn't like Dwayne Johnson. He doesn't, he didn't want to work with this team. That is the huge reason that he let go of Henry Cavill. Come on, you don't have to be a scientist to figure that out. That is so obvious. He didn't want to work with uh, Dwayne Johnson and he didn't want to work with Henry Cavill. Because, uh, because ever since he took over to DC, the only person he fired so far is Henry Cavill. Everyone else is around, you know. He's trying to work with all this cast. Even Gal Gadot, he isn't, she isn't gone, you know. She's still around. Although I don't know if she will be in Flash movie or not. If she's in that movie, that would be amazing. Uh, all this cameo they cut out from Flash movie. That is really huge mistake. Then again, I think, you know, you have to... Because they're rebranding uh, their brand with this crazy guy on Twitter. I don't know. He's just damaging the brand overall, I feel like. And that was my thought on this. Let me know in the comment. What do you think about this and the news? And if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like that video on other topics. If you enjoyed this, please subscribe. Until I see you next time, please take care.